Record. All right, so this is a copperhead that we caught last night in the highway, like more than likely would have ended up just smashed by a vehicle. Um, we do this a lot. We probably re uh, relocated 30 copperheads as the summers went on, just taking them from places where there's high populations of people and vehicles to places where there's a lot lower population of people and vehicles. Uh, this is a pretty large copperhead. It's the largest one we think we caught this summer. Um, we took her to a local ramp and going to release her into the Washtenaw National Forest, uh, really not far from where she got caught, but the direction I'm going to try to head her in, she should never see people again and just be able to carry out her life eating mice and lizards and shrews and maybe chipmunks and things like that from time to time, but we'll just see how it goes and do what we can to keep her safe and get her away from people. I mean, easy to get a better grip on your tail. It's just a really beautiful snake. It's a large copperhead, good sized adult. And all we are was about herptile preservation, reptile preservation. Try to keep the local venomous population as safe as we can. Uh, do our part. I bet we've saved at least 50 or 60 lives this summer so far. And I mean, just how beautiful a snake is this? It doesn't need to be killed on sight. It just needs to be left alone and respected, or in my case, I will take them to a place where they are left alone so that respect is demanded.